When you drop a piece of food on the floor, is it really safe to eat if you pick it up within 5 seconds? This urban myth claims that if food spends just a few seconds on the floor, dirt and germs won't have enough time to contaminate it. Research has recently focused on how food and contact surfaces become contaminated, and now a food scientist has now revealed the truth about what happens when food is dropped. In 2007, the lab at Clemson University published a study in the Journal of Applied Microbiology. Experts wanted to know if the length of time food is in contact with a contaminated surface affected the rate of transfer of bacteria to the food. To find out, the team inoculated squares of tile, carpet, or wood with salmonella. Five minutes after they placed either bologna or bread on the surface for 5, 30, or 60 seconds, and then measured the amount of bacteria transferred to the food. They found that the amount of bacteria transferred to either kind of food didn't depend much on how long the food was in contact with the contaminated surface, whether for a few seconds or for a whole minute. The overall amount of bacteria on the surface mattered more, and this decreased over time after the initial inoculation. The team also found that the kind of surface made a difference as well. Carpets, for instance, seem to be slightly better places to drop your food than wood or tile. When carpet was inoculated with salmonella, less than 1% of the bacteria were transferred. But when the food was in contact with tile or wood, 48% to 70% of bacteria transferred.